Hey Jim, welcome to the Valley of Southern New Jersey. It's good to be here. Good. Tell me about this amazing facility. Well, where we're at right now was built in 1850 and it was bought and sold several times. The Scottish Rite Masons bought the property in 1930 and built our stage and ballroom in 1931. Which is awesome. Currently, we still own the building, but we're under a lease with the borough of Collingswood. They maintain the building, have all the events, and we still have all our events as well. Tell me about what makes this valley tick. Uh, we have uh, approximately 1,400 members, and uh, we're very pleased with the amount of activity we get from our members to come and visit this place. Yeah, that's exciting because you and I have had this discussion before. When I measure Valley of Excellence, it's do the members want to come and participate? And do, does the Valley offer those type of things that makes them want to come? Absolutely. We have a social dinner every month, different menu, different caterer, uh, same price it's been for the last 10 years. We have uh, an open bar, ample parking, and it's just a comfortable place to be. It, is there a ghost in this place? I feel like, is there a ghost here? There is a history where two people who owned the building prior to the Masons have died. And we suspect that at least one of them hasn't left yet. Mm -hmm. uh, there's very few sightings, a couple. Mm -hmm. There's been various things happening, nothing gruesome, always things like glasses moving, lights going off and on. Of course, the wiring's from 1931, that might explain the Maybe lights a little bit. Maybe a little bit. Thanks for taking the time. My pleasure. All right. All right. Hello, George. Good to Brian. meet you. Nice to see you. Good to be here. I love this theater. I, I was here years ago, and I, I had the experience of touring this incredible building. You guys run this theater. Tell me about how you work this building. It's a beautiful building. We have an agreement with the town of Collingswood, and uh, they do the maintenance and whatnot, which allows us to maintain this building, which would cost a fortune otherwise. And uh, I mean, we love it. Uh, it. It's perfect for everything that we do. Absolutely. Yeah. Between the ballroom and a full theater, full yeah. stage, it's a it's, it's a, a lot to work. It's a great with. venue. And I notice you have you have great prop storage all around. I you know you. We're doing the 18th degree, which is, you know, that's a loaded degree, right? It's one of the two Rose Croix degree. And it's, uh, there's a lot involved with that. And I noticed you guys had all the scenery and everything you needed. It's grown over time. And it's, it's been growing for such a long time that a lot of the, a lot of the material it needs to be refurbished or replaced because yeah. some of it goes back to the 20s. Yeah, absolutely. And coupe costumes uh, back in the 20s, so they were uh, they were made like asbestos. Right. <laughs> they would wear forever, but uh, we're all a little bit bigger than we used to be. Yeah. Are your drops from the 20s? Some of your some, some of them were. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I know you know you're very involved with your with your degree productions here. You have a you have a pretty good cast, lineup, your actors, how does that work for you? Well, this degree is um, a statewide degree, so Excellent. everybody in this degree uh, is not from our valley. We, we've uh, gotten people from all three of the valleys. There's been a lot of challenges and they've stepped up and have done a phenomenal job. And, and we've been fortunate enough that uh, hopefully we can in the future continue to be fortunate that we were able to double cast a lot of the positions. Yeah. Yes. And if you have that luxury, it makes it takes a lot of pressure off because sure. you never know when something's going to happen the day of. Especially right. with COVID. So Larry, I have to believe that this has got to be one of the centerpieces for Valley Life here in the Valley of Southern New Jersey. Yep. Absolutely that it is. We have all our Friday night dinners are here and uh, we do our installation and stuff in here. Our regular small business meetings are in the conference room, but we do everything else is done in here. But this isn't what it used to look like. No, no, not whatsoever. This uh, back in 76 when I joined, this looked like a prison lunchroom. It was a tiled floor. There was no staircase here whatsoever. So what's the most exciting thing about being a member from the Southern New Jersey? I'd say probably the activity. You know, we get tremendous attendance at our uh, monthly dinners and uh, the guys are very, very active, very enthused about it. Uh, I think that's probably one of the things I like most about this, this valley.